Hi, I am Christoph Kuan, and this is my international coding showcase project, Connect4. I was inspired to create this program by my childhood experiences of playing the game. I created this program because in this time of the pandemic, especially with the many ongoing lockdowns worldwide, I wanted to be able to find a way to entertain people using my knowledge in programming and Python. Users are first greeted with a welcome message, followed by the rules of the game. Player 1 is then prompted to select which color they would like to play with. The way the color selection works is that the program gets the coordinate of the user's click, as seen over here, and checks whether it is on the left side of the display or the right side of the display. After player 1 selects a checker color, for instance, red, the program creates the game grid using the function over here. Players alternate turns to drop their checkers in the grid. When a player clicks on a certain column, the checker with their color gets drawn in the bottom most empty square in that column, for instance, this column. The way that the program distinguishes which player's turn it is is through the turn variable as seen over here. The turn variable is initially set to 1, then every time a player drops a checker in one of the squares, it increases by 1. If the turn is odd, then the checker with the color of the player who goes first in that game will be dropped, whereas if the turn is even, then the checker with the color of the player who goes second in that game will be dropped, as seen in the code over here. Furthermore, I made sure that the program included error handling to be able to handle misinputs in gameplay. For instance, in this section, if the user were to click on an already occupied space, then an error message would appear. So, the way that the program checks if a player has won the game is through checking if four checkers of the same color have been connected vertically, horizontally, or diagonally. To facilitate this, I created the square class, as seen over here, giving each square on the grid a color attribute whose value gets updated with the color of the checker that gets placed in that square. If a player has won, a message showing the winner of the game will be displayed on the grid. However, if there is a tie, then a tie message will appear on the grid. After this, users will be prompted to either press the X button to quit the game or continue the game by pressing any key. If the user chooses to continue the game, then the player who went second in the previous game will go first in the new game. Whereas, if the user were to press the X button, then the program will display an exit message and close itself.